And now your exclusive Storm Team 3 forecast from KTVO. We'll see some quiet conditions above normal temperatures to continue. But the real question is, how long is it going to last? But right now, let's take a look at the KTVO Sky Cam. Uh, that's located on top of the Kirksville City Hall, brought to you by Heritage House Realty and King's Appliance. Uh, pretty uh, calm conditions across Kirksville. We do have some cloudy skies. A little bit of activity pushing through northeast Missouri, especially into maybe near, near La Plata and into southern portions of Macon with some sprinkles or some light showers. This is from a little disturbance off to the west that moved just a little bit farther north than what was anticipated along with those cloudy skies. Uh, so those cloudy skies will continue as we're heading into the evening hours. We'll start to see a little bit of decreasing though to partly cloudy as we're heading into the overnight. But those temperatures right now, that's what we're going to be talking about this week. 46 degrees right now at the Kirksville Regional Airport. Southwest winds around 7 miles per hour. Tumwuff looking at 45 degrees. Southwest winds around 11 miles per hour. So we have seen some very brisk winds over the last couple of days. Uh, we will remain out of the southwest for tonight around 5 to 10 miles per hour. Those winds are going to be switching to the northwest as we're heading throughout the day on Wednesday with gusts up to 24 miles per hour. We've already seen a grass fire for today. Uh, so over the next couple of days into Tuesday and into Wednesday, we are going to see some breezy conditions. So not a good idea to burn outdoors over the next couple of days. We have dry conditions, uh, lower relative humidity levels, and those brisk winds. So those do not uh, mesh up for a good idea to burn outdoors. So just wait a few more days. Uh, those northerly winds are going to be bringing in just a little bit cooler air as we're heading into tomorrow night and into Wednesday. But for tonight, temperatures are dropping down only into the 30s for tonight. We're back up into the 50s for Tuesday, 20s for tomorrow night, and into the 40s. Still not too bad for Wednesday. What we can expect over the next 12 hours, temperatures to fall about 34 degrees at 3 in the morning. By 7 a.m., we're looking at about 32 degrees with partly cloudy skies. 31 degrees as your overnight low. Our average for this time of year is about 18 degrees. That is well above normal for this time. Southwest winds around 5 to 10 miles per hour. A nice day shaping up on Tuesday as well as into Wednesday for Valentine's Day. We'll see quiet and calm conditions with mostly sunny skies for both Tuesday and into Wednesday. Temperatures for Valentine's Day, it is going to be very nice. Uh, we're looking back up into the lower 50s, around 51 degrees. We'll top out with those northwest winds gusting to 24 miles per hour. Here's the extended five-day forecast. Take a look at these temperatures. The warmest day is going to come on Friday and into the weekend. 43 degrees on Wednesday, back up into the upper 50s for Thursday. 63 degrees we're topping out on Friday. Of course, anytime, check us out 24-7 at KTVO.com. Not too bad for February. Bring it on. We'll take it. Thanks. Coming up next is...